When we set out to design Wardium, what we wanted to do is to create an oasis, connecting people with nature. At every point of your experience in the building, you experience the outside. So whilst you're inside, the outside is prevalent. It's re-examining and connecting with some very old ideas about the place of landscape. I think there's something very powerful about that in that it connects you with a pulse of life. Maybe life is more exciting and more vivid when there's less distractions. So it's partly about mental well-being, but it's also about physical well-being as well. There's a rich program from the pool to the gym. There's some spa spaces as well. The plan was very much not just to give a panoramic view of the cityscape, but was to mediate that and sometimes frame a view, create moments of calm and beauty within the building. There's something about it in terms of its proportion, the arrangement of spaces, and the way that light flows through it that feels very, very elegant. The extension of the inside to outside across the balcony sort of just makes everything feel more relaxed and more generous, a counterpoint to harsh urban life. Every part of the building has got its own quality to it, which then asks you to sort of reflect and look at it and enjoy it. I think that's a really important thing as well. Wardian's big, but actually what I think makes it amazing is the attention to the small. It is actually an antidote to the urban environment. It's a moment of calm and peace, changing and enhancing people's lives.